Welcome to Dev Código, where we don't teach what to learn, but how to learn it. Now, here's your host, M. H. Hello and welcome again to another episode of Dev Código. For this episode, babalikan lang natin ang in-unbox natin na USB 3.0 wireless network interface. So, basically... Uh, ginagawa nitong device na ito kinoconvert niya yung desktop mo na wala namang wireless o wifi capability into a wifi enabled device so nabili ko siya sa Lazada around 600 pesos and as you can see naka open itong task manager ko sa windows uh, just to correct myself sinabi ko na hindi supported yung 802.11 AC but fortunately supported siya so so as you can see here in my task manager I'm using an 802.11 AC interface all right so dito kasi sa Windows machine ko nilagyan ko siya ng PCIe wireless interface so kung mapapansin mo meron ako dito ng dalawang wifi interface so wifi 2 currently dinisable ko muna just to test yung um, USB 3.0 na wireless LAN okay and then dito sa bahay we have a router na both 5 gigahertz and 2.8 gigahertz capable So dito sa kumaka- kumakikita nyo meron akong several SSIDs. So yung Ethneb na currently nakakonek ako is a 2.8 gigahertz um, connection. Alright? So currently yan ang gamit ko. And try nating mag uh, speed test gamit yan. So mag open ako ng speed test. check natin kung marireach natin yung 100 Mbps. So yung connection ko, internet connection ko is around 100 Mbps. And yung distance pala nitong PC na to from the router. So currently nasa second floor ako. And yung distance ko is around siguro mga 3 meters, 4 meters. So sabihin natin 5 meters away from the router since nasa taas ako. Alright, so mag-run tayo ng speed test. Okay, so pumapalo siya ng 50 Mbps. Alright, so for this test, yung ating 2.8 gigahertz ay merong 43 Mbps download and 68 Mbps na upload. So not bad, okay? So try natin yung uh, try natin yung 5 gigahertz. Okay, so yan. So, kumonect na siya automatic na sa 5 gigahertz And let's just rerun the test. Yan. So, kumapalo siya ng 150 actually. Pero, nagtatrottle down. Ayaw ni PLDT na nakakalamang tayo. Alright. So, that's 102 Mbps for download. And for upload... Yan, so throttle down din siya. So 
So, ano naisip kong reason bakit mas mabagal yung 2.8? Actually, kaya naman yata. So, don't quote me on this. Kaya naman yata ni 2.8 GHz ma-max out yung 100 Mbps ko. So, aside dun sa distance, so, obviously, mas stable yung 5 GHz connection ko. Siguro loaded din yung SSID ko na yun, no? Kasi, uh, most of the cellphones here sa bahay, hindi pa 5 GHz capable. So, yun yung default connection talaga. Ayan. Mas marami siyang load compared dun sa 5 GHz. Alright, so I guess that's that's the quick testing nitong nabili natin USB 3.0 wireless LAN. So, I guess sulit na rin to. Uh, may iwasan yung maraming kable. So, hopefully mas tidy na yung setup nyo sa bahay pagka gumamit kayo nitong Wi-Fi device na to. Alright, so I guess that's it for this episode of Dev Godigo. Don't forget to subscribe kung hindi ka pa nakasubscribe. Watch out for more unboxing, reviews, and tutorials. And once again, this is MH. Cheers! <laughs>